show that each of the relation capital R in the set A is equal to x belongs to Z such that x lies between 0 and 12 including 0 and 12 given by 1 R is equal to ordered pair A comma B such that mod of A minus B is a multiple of 4 and second one R is equal to ordered pair A comma B such that A is equal to B is an equivalence relation and we need to find the set of all elements related to one in each case so let us consider the first case r is equal to set a comma b such that mod of a minus b is a multiple of 4 So for any A belongs to A, let us consider from the set, given set A is equal to X belongs to Z integers 0 less than or equals to X less than or equals to 12. So let us consider any element A belongs to capital A such that A minus A which is equal to 0 or mod of a minus a will be also equal to 0 which is a multiple of which is a multiple of 4 which means that from 0 to 12 any integer you consider the number minus the same number will get 0 so which is always a multiple of 4 so we can say a comma a must belongs to the relation so which implies that r is reflexive for reflexive and next one for symmetric let a comma b belongs to the relation then we can say mod of a minus b is a multiple of 4 is a multiple of 4 which implies mod of b minus a is also a multiple of 4 just there is a change of sign it is also a multiple of 4 whereby we can say that b comma a belongs to r so for a comma b therefore for a comma b belongs to r there is a b comma a belongs to r hence r is symmetric r is symmetric now let us consider for transitive let a comma b belongs to r and b comma c belongs to r so that mod of a minus b is a multiple of 4 let us consider 4 into some k1 where k1 is an integer and b minus c is also a multiple of 4 so 4 into k2 where k1 and k2 are integers so we can also write a minus b is equal to plus or minus 4 k1 and a b minus c is equal to plus or minus 4 k2 then if you add this both or we can add a minus b plus b minus c which is equal to plus or minus 4k1 plus of plus or minus 4k2 that is a minus c is equal to plus or minus 4 times of some constant so that is a minus c that is mod of a minus c is a multiple of k some constant multiple of 4 sorry so that is a comma c 
a comma c belongs to r therefore we can say that for a comma b belongs to r and b comma c belongs to r so there is a a comma c belongs to r so we can say r is r is transitive so r is reflexive symmetric and transitive and hence we can say hence the relation hence r is r is an equivalence relation now let's find the elements which are related to one since r is equal to a comma b such that a minus b is a multiple of 4 so which is equal to so we can write the ordered pairs 1 comma the difference must be multiple of 4 so we can take 1 comma 5 1 comma 9 and even 1 comma 1 we can consider and 9 comma 1 we can consider and 5 comma 1 and any multiples difference of uh, multiple of 4 either 8 or it should be 12 so we can say so 13 is not possible up to 12 only we should consider so 1 comma 5 1 comma 9 1 comma 1 5 comma 1 and 5 comma 9 comma 1 So the elements which are related to 1 we can write that is equivalence class of 1 we can write it as 1, 5, 9. So these are the elements which are related to 1. Now let's see another case. R is equal to A comma B such that A is equal to B. Let's consider here. R is equal to second case a comma b such that a is equal to b so for every element a belongs to a we can say that a is equal to a itself so that is a comma a belongs to r and hence we can say r is reflexive and for symmetric let a comma b belongs to r which implies that a is equal to b then which also implies that b is equal to a so we can say b comma a belongs to r so for a comma b belongs to r b comma a belongs to r so we can say it is symmetric and for transitive third one let a comma b belongs to r b comma c belongs to r so that a is equal to b and b is equal to c so when a is equal to b and b is equal to c we can write a is equal to c so which implies that a comma c belongs to r and hence we can say r is transitive therefore it is a reflexive symmetric and transitive hence r is an equivalence relation Now we need the elements which are related to 1 in this case since a is equal to b so we can find the relation r is equal to related to 1 
only one ordered pair one comma one so we can say equivalence class of one is only a single element one 